I literally pick my nose every time. Hey guys, hey guys, come on in, come on in. So, uh, my name is Casey Eberhardt, and I'm going to be doing a mobile pocket presentation with Gabe here, and we're going to go through the presentation from start to finish. So, if you're just joining us, we'd love to have you. If you have any questions, you can hit me up on Facebook. We'll post this video up for training purposes as well. If you're watching this video and this sounds like something that you're interested in, don't hesitate to reach out to the person that brought you to this video, and or you can find me on Facebook as well. So, let's go ahead and get started so we can roll through this. So. Gabe, welcome tonight. Hey, appreciate appreciate you being here. This is this is our friend Gabe. Um, this is not a setup. Gabe and I we kind of know each other, but not not very well. I asked him to um, please be specific in questions, and he knows that this is this is for you. So you ready? Yep. Let's get fired up. So Gabe, tell me a little bit about your business. All right. Uh, well, what I do is I do events. Specifically photo booths. So um, pretty much what we do is we show up to fancy events, you know, whether it be weddings uh, Sweet 16s, bat mitzvahs, and we set up photo booths. We're usually there two to three hours and you know We provide entertainment and great memories. That's awesome And so people rent these photo booths, right? Yes, and what they're really doing is they're creating memories for yes, themselves as right? well as entertainment Yeah, awesome. And so um, do you ever do them for like speaker seminars? Not yet. That is, yeah. Right now it's huge, just special events. It's going to be a huge market. Trust yeah. me, my friend. Well, cool. So as a business owner, let me tell you how I got involved in the Central Cars, just because I can talk to you business guy to business guy, right? Right. So I used to own an equipment rental company for film and television equipment. And um, at that in that business, we had a marketing budget of $80,000 a year. And that was to go one ad in one place. 80 grand. So every month I had to shell away eight grand to save up for next year's marketing marketing budget. We had basically one shot to do the whole thing. Now it's a little bit different because we got the internet, right? This right. is before Al Gore invented it. And, um, <laughs> right? Right. And so um, a, a friend of mine called me up out of the blue and he said, Hey, do you ever send out thank you cards to your clients? And I said, No. And he said, Well, why not? I said, Well, look, it's a pain. It's expensive. I don't, I'm not going to, I'm just lazy. I don't have their addresses. I don't get their addresses. I said, Look. And he goes, Well, I have this system. And I said, Look, Peter, unless you're telling me that there's some system out there that will print the card, put it in an envelope, put a stamp on it, print print the whole thing up, and take it to the post office, I have no interest. And he said, well, then I'm going to keep talking. And I said, well, then my credit card's out. And that was really how it happened. I signed up on the spot, and we started using it in the business. And so what we would do is we would send cards to every time we would do a bid on a show, we would always send out cards to everybody that was involved in that show. So in your case, like the event planner, the, the bride and groom, or the mother mother of the of the kid being bat mitzvah, whatever. Um, and our business took off like crazy. Now I will say just in the interest of disclosure, we we I originally bought the system because I thought, oh how great it is gonna be to put my logo everywhere and coupons and maps and email and phone number and all that. And we didn't get the result we wanted. Um, but when we started really appreciating our clients and really saying thank you and not putting all that marketing crap on it, it really changed our business forever. And we started doubling revenues every month. It was crazy. So much so that within three months, we dropped the next year's 80 grand marketing thing. So for me, it was like the best thing since sliced bread. Well, in the middle of all of that, um, I went and had lunch with my insurance agent. And her name was Deb. And we were talking and I said, Deb, I think I found like the holy grail of marketing. She says, what are you talking about? And I said, it's this goofy card thing. She's like, we send cards. I said, no, you try to send cards, but you send me a birthday card every year saying, happy birthday, come in and talk about life insurance, <laughs> right? Which is like the worst kind of birthday card ever. So I said, well, let me show it to you. So we sent a card to her mom and it was, you know, you know, miss your mom, love you, whatever. I didn't even think anything of it. Went away and a couple weeks later, I get a check from send out cards. So I like call send out cards corporate. I'm like, why are you sending me a check? They're like, well, what's your ID number? I'm like, I'm not telling you. I don't want to give my check back. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> so she's clickety-clack, clickety-clack on her computer. And she finally says, do you know Deb? And I said, yeah. And she said, well, she signed up. And I said, signed up for what? She goes, to use send-out cards. And I said, yeah, so? So we went back and forth. And she said, well, you know, you get paid if somebody signs up. And I said, what are you talking about? I was just showing her because I thought it was cool. She says, well, no, you get didn't the guy that brought you on explain this to you? And I said, no. And so that's when I said, 
let's go build a business. When I finally understood that from an entrepreneurial standpoint that I could build my equipment rental business at the same time as helping other business owners and other people create a second stream of income for themselves and ultimately Sendo Cards became my primary sense of income, right? And so here, here we sit nine years later having a blast, making a bunch of money, having a great time. So the reason I want to show this presentation to you from start to finish, both how the system works but also the money, is so that you don't have the same experience that I did, which is you're not armed with all the information. So as long as you're armed with all the information, I want to let you know that I have no emotional attachment one way or the other, whether you join or not, right? If you say this is the coolest thing since sliced bread, I'm in, I'm going to go raw. And if you say this is the dumbest thing ever, I'm going to go raw, he's an idiot. <laughs> right? No pressure. No pressure. All right. Right? <laughs> so, <laughs> um, so when we, when we first started, you know, I, I remember that I asked you this question and we just wrote this down on this little card. So it was the, the simple question is this, if I could show you a way to make some money with your smartphone, sharing an app that everybody loves to use, would you want to see it? And I believe your answer was hells. Yeah. Of course. If I, <laughs> if I remember right. So um, I'm just going to set that over there for the purposes of, of the conversation. So let me show you how the app works. So um, Bruce took our picture right before right before we started, and the only reason was to say to save a little time. But imagine when you guys are when when the crew's out setting up the photo booth, snapping pictures of the venue, snapping a picture of the parents, snapping a picture of the the bride or the groom or whatever, and really being able to do all the follow up right from your front seat of your car. Right, so here's how this here's how this app works. So I've just logged into the app. Um, once it's loaded on your phone, you're you're always logged into your account. Okay, so I'm just gonna we have about eighteen. Uh, yeah, there's about eighteen thousand cards to choose from in all these different categories. We have Spanish speaking cards, French speaking cards. I think we have French. I could be totally wrong on that. Oh no, we do French, French and Spanish. Whew. Um, I hardly ever use that because I understand that marking a moment in time with a picture is way more valuable than something being set on the outside of the card. So let's go ahead and build you a card. So I just am going to touch that. And then um, what I'm going to do here is, is I'm going to go in here and I'm going to say um, that we're going to do a up-down card. I call them up-down. I, I can never remember vertical or horizontal. So um, I'm, not that, I'm not that smart, right? So down here we have we can do a three-panel card. We could do a giant card. I mean, you really want to have some impact with somebody. You could do a big card. It's about the size of a piece of notebook paper, okay? So I'm just going to touch this here, create card. It's going to simply say front. I'm going to touch this and add a picture. Now, the cool thing is I could take a picture from the phone with the phone right here and right now, or I could use a photo that we've taken previously, or I could use a photo that's already inside the store or already inside my account. Now, I'll tell you just for the um, just kind of as a hint. I always like to take the photos before I log in because if you log in and then take the photo and for some reason the app crashes or you lose cell service or you're in a room where you don't get cell coverage, you'll lose the picture if the, if the mm -hmm. app crashes. So I always like to take it ahead of time. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to tap this picture. This is the one that we took beforehand. It's going to load this right on the card. Okay. So I can move it a tiny bit. I don't have that much leeway. And once it's locked, I just touch it and that locks the card in. Okay. Okay. Now I'm just gonna play like I'm 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 using another website where you swipe it to the left. Okay. All <laughs> right. Um, I'm glad that you it's know a good what website. I, I know. I'm glad I know. I'm glad you know what I'm talking about. Um, so now I say on the inside inside top of the card, but just for we can type we can write a message inside there. But just for the purposes of of moving along, I'm gonna just go straight to the bottom of the card. Okay. So I'm just going to tap, tap inside the bottom. It's going to open up what's called the editor, which is where basically we create that message on the inside of the card. Okay. Yep. Now you do have the ability to put pictures and all that kind of stuff inside the card. I like to just keep them simple because I'd rather do production before perfection. So I don't spend a lot of time making the cards. I'm more interested in making sure that the feeling I want to get across to somebody is done in a timely fashion. Right. Okay. So first thing I can do here is I click this F. Here's all the fonts that you can choose from, and if you choose the web, if you build a card on the website, you can actually have your own um, your own handwriting font in there as well. So I just like envelope hand; it just makes it makes it easy there. And then I can tap this uh, these A's, and that makes the font size bigger or smaller. So, for example, if you were going to send a card to one of the grandparents of somebody. You might want to make the text a little bit bigger so that they could actually see it, <laughs> right. right? I send a card to my grandmother almost every day, and she has a hard time seeing it. So I make the 
font really, really big and it's only a few words. Have an awesome day, Grandma. Like, that's it, okay? And then I go right here to this, this paint can and this paint can, you can choose one of the colors off to the side or you can use your finger and, and swipe it down and put the, put the little guy there and, um, and then uh, go right back to the text here and now we're into editing. Okay, now, okay. you're much younger than I am, so this will probably appeal to you, but you could click this little microphone there and actually talk your card in there. Um, my autocorrect is horrible, and... Uh, it's, you just gotta check the typos <laughs> before you check, send something embarrassing, type, right? Yeah, so, and it somehow knows all the embarrassing words that, that I use. So, <laughs> so what I'm doing is I'm just gonna type, type a quick message here. So, hey, Gabe. And, okay. Okay, so we go here. <laughs> I try to be more deliberate, but... Is photo booth one word? Uh, you could do either or. Dude, I hope you get more business. So I just simply typed a message, you know, hey Gabe, thanks for being so awesome. Anything I can do to help you get more photo booth business, I am in your buddy Casey and my phone number. Cool. Okay. Just click done. So there's what the there's what the, the bottom of the there's what the bottom of the card looks like. Okay. Um so then I'm just gonna add the add the card to um to the shopping cart. It's a pretty standard looking shopping cart. As soon as it shows up there, I know that it's in. And I'm always a guy that likes to add gifts. So you don't have to add a gift. We have about 1,850 gifts to choose from. Um, I'm, I'm just a guy, there's every kind of gift in here imaginable. Cookies, candies, books, um, wish jars, ties, blankets. There's just pretty much everything. Um, so you like brownies, right? Love them. Perfect. Even though we're in California, these are these are real brownies. They're not real brownies, right? <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna put up a two pack of brownies here. I just can add. I'm just gonna go ahead and add it to cart. This is how we built our equipment rental business. We sent brownies to everybody. It was awesome because they're like crack. I mean, they're just highly addict. Highly addicted. Nowadays, you gotta ask if they're gluten free, right? Exactly. <laughs> these are Before kosher. That's about all I know. They're, all right. <laughs> they're 440 calories of pure kosher goodness, um, fat and carb free today only. Just in this, just 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 your set. Um, okay, so now we're gonna just click the checkout button. It's gonna show my return at my return address. I'm gonna click continue to check out. Now, I'm at the recipient thing. Now, because you're not in my system already, I'm just gonna click new recipient. So what's great is like if you're at a networking event, I don't even take business cards to a networking event. What I do is I'll just say, hey, you know, hey Gabe, let me take a quick picture and I'll send you my information. I see. And I can do this pretty quick. I mean, I'm just showing you that's why it's, but I'm to a point where I can probably get a card in and out in like a minute and a half, two minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and click add recipient and we're gonna add you. So this is the screen that asks for all the information. So what I've done is um, I've written Gabe's I've written Gabe's info down so you guys can't see it. So I'm gonna go ahead and type in his um, information here. I said dumb ass auto text. <laughs> I like to play during close to the line. <laughs> <laughs> Do 
you're, if you're getting into my face where I've got that beard going, I promise you when I watch this. No, I got yeah. somebody else's face. <laughs> Ha! <laughs> this is the hardest part. Addresses. O T S E G O. Jeez, takes me longer to type in a bloody address. Gabe, yeah, what's your um, company's website name? Just so everybody at home can go check it out. No problem. Uh, it's Umbra, U-M-B-R-A, photobooth.com. It's that simple. Awesome. Out here in in the in, out here in Sherman Oaks, California, right? Yeah. If yeah. if if you're more comfortable looking it up at Yelp, you could just go to Yelp, Umbra Photo Booth. There you go. Perfect. Um, okay, so I've typed your address in here. Now Bruce isn't going to show the phone, but everybody at home will also see this. There's also um, when as soon as I click save as new contact, what it does is it allows me to put your email address in here and your phone number in here. So if I'm at a networking event, I can very quickly, very quickly do that, and now you're saved inside the system. Awesome. Okay. So I've just gone. I've just added you. I just click continue to checkout. It's then going to show me how much, um, how much everything costs. Okay, so it's just loading it in here. Okay, so it's it's gonna sh it's gonna show me the where it's going and mm -hmm. who it's who it's to. I click continue to checkout. Now it's gonna show me the payment. It's gonna show me that it costs thirteen points. I'll explain the points in a minute. Four dollars and fifty cents to to ship it. That's just the postage to ship the brownies. I click submit payment. And add abracadabra, Kalamazoo. Here we go. Your card is sent to you. Oh wow, that was a rhyme, and I didn't even know it. <laughs> right. So that's that's the app. So right now, tomorrow morning, they will have printed that card, attached brownies to it, wrapped it all up in a box, put the shipping label on it, and taken it to the post office. And and that card cost us ninety three cents. And nice. then the brownies were three dollars. So, and then we had a little bit of shipping. So you can see where the power of this is, especially when you're out at an event, being able to go, bam, mark a moment in time, send it out. Does that make sense? Yeah. Cool. Any questions? No. Awesome. It's good. And once the app is downloaded, it just sits on your phone. It's, it's, it's super easy. So um, let, me, let me show you how the money works in this deal, right? So we okay. have, if you want, so when you look at that, there's two different elements, right? You can come on board as a customer and send out cards or as what we call a marketing distributor, okay? So I'm going to I'm going to share with you that there are four types of people that that usually join us and send out cards, okay? And this is going to be really important towards the end of the presentation. So the first person we call number one. That's a person that when I get done showing you all the money here, you go, you know what? That's really awesome, and I get it. However, all I could do is obsess on using that phone app to send cards and gifts to my clients, to my prospects, uh, to my family. It's more of a customer, kind of a not not a massive volume user, okay? Um, and, and a customer, I'll go through pricing at, at the end. So number two is somebody that looks at all this money and goes, you know what, Case, that's awesome. I'm so busy in my photo booth business. I just, I don't have time to build a business, but I certainly know a bunch of people that could use this. I'll refer them to you. So in that case, we call that person a referral partner. Basically, you would sign up as a marketing distributor and then you would, um, I don't make cold calls, so don't send me cold, cold <laughs> people, you know, people that you just make a list and send. But if you talk to somebody or somebody says, how'd you do that? And they know that they're seeing a send out card presentation, pass them my way, I'll go do the presentation, or you and I can go do the presentation together. This cool. exact same presentation. It's the same every time I do it, right? Mm -hmm. So we call that a referral partner. Number three is somebody that looks at all this money and goes, that's awesome. Um, I think that's fantastic. I'm really looking to make somewhere between 200 and 1,000 bucks a month, right? So you have a car payment, or maybe it's a credit card payment, or maybe it's rent. You go, I just want to be able to make a little bit of money every month. So that I kind of call a part-time income, you know, up to a thousand bucks a month. We call that a number three. And then a fourth, a number four is somebody that looks at all that and goes, holy crap, this is super easy. There's a ton of money in this deal. You ain't get, it's saying to me, you ain't that good looking. You're not that smart. I can certainly do what you do. Let's go build a business together, right? And that is where um, kind of the full-time person, the person that sees the big future and the big value of building a big business, okay? 
Yeah. I can tell you that I fall into the number four category. Okay. <laughs> right. Now, obviously, I love working with the threes and the fours, but referral partners are awesome too because you can start building a check just by referring over some business. Does that make sense? Uh, yeah. Any questions? No. Okay. It's cool. Pretty clear. So I'm going to set that over here, over here again. So before I before I show you this, I want to just um, show you that there are a couple of disclaimer cards, and basically what these disclaimer cards are going to say is that I'm going to lay this out uh, to the best of my ability. But if I miss something or if I misstep um, in what I say in some of my language, um, that send out cards isn't responsible. I guess you can hold me responsible. But I'm going to tell you that um, I'm going to lay this out to the best of my abilities. But your results may vary. My results are going to vary as well. Does it make sense? Got it. Basically, just take this for what it is. Okay? okay. A dem demonstration purpose. Don't sue. Don't sue. Exactly. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Um, now, I also want to show you something else. So, um, we came up with this cool little deck of cards. We call this the mobile pocket presentation. Okay, and some people have watched this presentation and kept saying, "Case that I could never do that because you have to think too much." Well, it's not really that I'm thinking. I, I did a really cool magic trick. I put the number, um, the sequence of the card on the bottom, so that we just put those in order. So I'm not really that smart. I'm just putting them back in order at the end of every time. It, it pretty much tells me what, what card comes next. Okay, so. If you come on board as a customer, this doesn't apply. So this only really applies for the two, threes, and fours, the referral partner, the part-time income, and the full-time income person, okay. okay? And I'm gonna kind of give you my opinion as, as we go with this, okay? So the first thing that happens is you come on board and it's a $395 um, one time, okay? Now I think it's like 59 bucks a year to, to renew it. And that $395 is like the grand poobah package, right? It includes a couple of hundred points as long as you use them within the first 60 days. They don't expire. Points are how we send cards and gifts. So okay. a card is three points. So that's why that, um, that card was 13 points that we sent. It was three points for the card and then 10 points for the brownies. So points are used for cards and gifts. Does that make sense? Yeah. So this $395 includes your handwriting font and four signatures. It's a, it's a full-blown package. So it includes the ability to brand the back of a card so you can put your own photo booth business logo on the back, and that's how, I wish we had this back when I started, because I would have put, that's where I would have put Atomic's logo. Um, <laughs> right. Instead, I thought it would be better on the front, which was a, a bad misstep. So it uh, includes points, it includes the ability to earn a commission if you share this with other people. Your handwriting font um, gives you four signatures, so if, it, if you wanted to sign Gabe, Gabriel, you had somebody in your office that wanted to do that, we could insert different signatures okay. um, as different things, okay? So, when you first come on board, it's three ninety five. Now, if we we do we get three customers within the first, I think it's thirty days. Is it thirty days? Mm -hmm. Thirty days. If you get three customers within thirty days, send out cards is immediately going to cut you a check for fifty bucks. Three customers. <laughs> yep, three customers. Okay, a customer is going to cost thirty nine bucks a month, right? And right. that gives them a hundred points. So their points are thirty nine cents a piece. They buy a hundred points, thirty nine bucks a month. Their account keeps getting refilled with 100 points every single month. If, you don't, if they don't use them in a given month, they roll to the next month, like old cell phone minutes, right? Probably even before your day uh, of rollover cell phone minutes. But um, I, I experienced this. <laughs> okay. So now what I tell, tell people is, look, I want to take this $50 and I want to set this over here. I don't want you to even think about it because what I really want you to do is invest in two decks of cards. One for you and one for when somebody signs up. You can literally hand them a deck of cards because they're going to have to practice this presentation and they have it straight away. So when yep. you sign up tonight, I'm going to give you a deck of cards so you walk with a deck of cards. Does that make sense? Yeah. So I just kind of just cast that off to the side and say, let's just, don't, let's not even count it. Right. Okay. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to simply go out and start showing send out cards. We're going to do this exact same presentation. We ask people, hey, if I could show you a way to make money using your smartphone, sharing an app that everybody loves to use, would you want to see it? They say yes. We sit down, we spend a half hour and, and do this presentation. Make okay. sense? So, first thing that happens, somebody first comes on board, they see the value as well as a two, three, or four, they come on board as a marketing distributor, same deal, they're buying the same package at $3.95. Send out cards immediately is gonna cut you a check for 140 bucks. Okay? Straight away. They they just they they pay it pay it straight away. Okay? Yeah. Now remember that with with all of these, everybody is as a distributor. As a marketing distributor, instead of paying $39 a month like a customer, we get a di we spend less per month per point. So it's only $31 for us. So our points are only $0.31 cents a piece versus $0.39. Cents. Nice. Okay. Nice. 
And the customer has the option to upgrade. And, and, and obviously this is uh, this also applies for referral partners, right? Correct. So okay. this everything from here is all two, three, or four. Oh, yeah. Okay? So $140, we go out and we do the same exact thing. We sign up another person, another person comes aboard, send out cards, immediately send you a check for 140 bucks. Okay? So we're gonna show this again. Somebody comes on board again, 395, send out cards, pays you again 140 bucks. Okay? Now, a couple of things happen at this point. First off, you've got three people that are in, in your organization, and if you count the money, it's 140, 140, 140 equals 420. You now have made your money back. Okay. okay? Now, this isn't an, uh, we're not supposed to say it's an investment. I happen to, do, in my brain, think of it much like an investment. At this point, I'm kind of playing on house money, right? Yeah. So we also give you a promotion, and we also give you a big raise. So I'm gonna put this, I'm gonna put this pen here just to help delineate this. But remember that these folks we're gonna teach to do the same thing. So we're gonna teach these three folks to go get three people, to get three people, to get three people, so on and so forth, right? Yeah. Everybody's gathering a few customers, and we also get paid a residual on top of all of this upfront money. And I'll explain that at the end. Does so, that make sense? Yeah. Okay. So we give you the rank advancement of manager. So Kathy right here over my over my right shoulder, she hit manager yesterday. So yay for Kathy. Yes. I want her to be able to have that because in a couple of years when she's some big grand poobah in the whole deal, uh, she'll be able to go back and look and go, remember that? Um, so she just hit, brought on her third on her third her third marketing distributor yesterday. Okay. Okay. So now she's going to start building right here. Same same with you and I. We're going to start building here. So we go out and we do the same thing. We bring somebody on board for $3.95. They're buying the same package. Although this time, instead of send out cards paying you $140, bucks, send out cards, remember, they give you a big raise. Send out cards is going to pay you $240 bucks this time. Okay? Yeah. And then we're going to pretty much do the same thing. Send out cards is, again, going to pay you $240 bucks this time. And then we'll do that a third time. Boom. <laughs> I, I was getting a little panicked there thinking these cards were out of order. I, again, I'm not that smart. So, um, And then send out cards. We're going to do the same thing. Send out cards are going to give you a check. What do you think? That's awesome. And th these are people that you're bringing directly, right? Mm -hmm. cool. And you bring in directly. Now, at this point, we could still bring in people directly straight straight with us right here, and we'd get $240 every single time. Okay. Right? However, this is where it gets a little bit hot and sexy. Okay? So now, remember that we're going to teach everybody to bring in three folks. Right? Okay. So let's say that this person goes out and brings in their first person. Send out cards is going to pay you a hundred bucks. Okay. And then let's say this person over here brings in somebody. Send out party cards pays you a hundred bucks. Okay. okay. And then let's say this person brings on their second person because they've got a larger network. They have a bigger list than somebody that doesn't know anybody. Right. So send out cards is going to pay you a hundred bucks again. Okay. And then this person brings in their third person. Right. What do you think send out cards are going to pay you? 100. 100 bucks, right? Okay, and then this person goes, holy crap, this is awesome. So they bring in their first person. Send out cards is again going to pay you 100 bucks. Okay? And then this person goes, well, my sister is going to come on board this thing. And they go sign her up. Send out cards. That, that's the sister. Send out cards are going to pay you 100 bucks, right? Mm hmm. And then let's say this person finally says, oh, I better bring in my second person. So they brought it, go and bring in a second person. Send out cards are going to pay you. What do you think? A hundred. hundred bucks. Exactly. Okay. And then um, this, let's say this person brings in their second person. Send out cards is again going to pay you. A hundred. hundred bucks. Exactly. And then this person right here goes, wait a second. Why not me? Well, because they haven't done anything, right? So they finally go out and they, they finally bring in their first person. Okay. So send out cards is going to pay you. 100 bucks. 100 bucks, exactly. Okay? Now, here, um, all kinds of bells and whistles go off. Here, the president of the company is going to like put your picture all over Facebook and congratulate you and say how awesome you are. When we get this room filled, all kinds of bells and whistles go off, right? Okay. So here's what's happened. We have 12 people in this group. Three of them came from us. The other nine came in any combination thereafter. Okay? okay? Now, we theoretically could put all 12 personally, but once we have 12 people in this group, um, we got to put another pen down because we gave you another promotion. We call you now a senior manager, and now you make even more money. Okay. So just because um, you're a smart guy, I don't normally say this to people, but 
Um, there's three more levels above this. Okay. To put this in perspective, I'm two above this. And when I bring in somebody personally, out of 395, I make 320. And when they bring in somebody, I make 180. Nice. Okay? So you can see how the more people win, the faster we get up to these groups up here, it just cranks, it just cranks the money, right? So yeah. remember up here I said I make 17%. Okay? That's important in a second. So let's bring her back down to this first group. So we've got all this money coming in. These people are bringing in people. These people are bringing in people. Everybody's getting a few customers to get that 50 bucks. Um, and then there's a residual component, right? So there's upfront money, and then there's residual. We get paid a little piece of the action off of all the points that are bought. So yep. if somebody buys 100 points, we get, we get a residual based on that 100 points. They buy 500 points in a month, we get the, we get the residual based on the 500 points, okay? Yep. Now, in this first group, because you're just getting started, um, your residual in this room for all the dollars that roll through this organization, send out cards are going to give you 2% of that every single month. Okay. So you go, ah, 2% is not really that, not really that much, so on and so forth. But if we multiply this out through the, through the, the wonder of leverage, right, we get a little piece of the action off the efforts of a bunch of people. So everybody does a little bit. We all make a ton of money. Okay. okay? So if we, every, remember we taught everybody to just get three and get their money back, right? Huh? not an investment, I might be using the wrong language of getting your money back. You will have made $420 and you had put in 395. Okay. You had purchased a package for the 95. Okay, if we did that and we cut it down at seven levels, um, just because we had to stop it somewhere, um, your residual component every single month for just these three people would be around 16 grand per month. Every single month, month after month after month after month. And that's paid out monthly, okay? Now, remember when I said we move to this room and we get a big raise? Yeah. We get about a 350% raise. So instead of 2% in this group, in this group we make 7%. Okay? Wow. We make 7% of every dollar that rolls through this organization infinite levels deep. Okay? But for the purposes of um, keeping kind of apples to apples and oranges to oranges, um, let's just take it down seven levels and stop. Okay. If we did that in just this group, so this group is growing over here. We got this group growing as a second as a second group. In this group, that same residual, taking it down seven levels, is going to equal about thirty-six grand per month, month over month over month. That's with everybody just getting a few customers and everybody bringing on a few people. So we combine those; it equals about fifty grand, right, per month. Now, you and I both know that that sounds great. But we also know that not everybody does what they're supposed to. Remember, this guy waited really long until he finally decided to do something, right? Right. So I, in my brain, I always go, look, I like to play the low numbers. So I say, look, if 90% of this fails, if it goes to hell in a handbasket, 90% of the people don't even do what they're supposed to, if we only are really working on a 10% success rate, we're still at about five grand per month as a solid residual income, in addition to all of this upfront money. Does that make sense? Yeah. Do you have any questions? No. Cool. That's... So, no questions. Um, other than where do I sign up? <laughs> where do I sign up? <laughs> no. Um, so if this person gets, for example, a new customer, I don't get a fifty anymore, right? Correct. You do. You... They, they get the fifty. Correct. Oh, okay. Correct. So right. basically, from the customers, it's basically the spending points that I, that I yep. get. Yep. Okay. Yep. And it, and if it's a customer, it's a great question. In a customer. This is where it's really cool. If it's a personal customer of yours, you actually make 20%. Nice. Okay? So, but if a customer comes in under like this person, you're going to make yeah. 2%. If a customer comes in under this person, 7%. Seven, seven, right? right? Awesome. But if a customer comes in on, on you, you make 20%. Okay. Of cool. every dollar they spend. Cool. Okay? Um, so, cool. So, help me do this. Um, I want to just count this money real quick. So, let's divide this up. I'll take the app card. You take the, you take the money. And let's just divide it and make it rain, right? Make it rain, exactly. Spoken like a young a young kid. God bless. <laughs> I love talking to young entrepreneurs. It's just awesome. Is this your busy season? It's yeah. This, this I was supposed to have a gig today, but um, they bailed, so. Oh, that's awesome. Well, so I feel it's awesome time. for us. Yeah. yeah. For sure. And I'll tell you, the cool thing about uh, what we have here is we do we do an event here every Wednesday night. So you have a place to plug people into. And if you cool. send a guest out or a friend or a buddy out, we take good care of them. 
if they sign up, they sign up. We've signed them up under your number. Nice. Okay. Nice. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So that's two forty. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I'm sure Help me out with the math. <laughs> no, that's okay. Um, Somebody's two, been to Vegas. Two, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Yeah. So 18, 1800 plus 240 is 2040 bucks, right? So yeah. so it's 2000, 2040 bucks was just the upfront money in just those first two worms. And those hundreds keep coming in. The next one gets a little bit more money. The next one obviously gets a little bit more money, so on and so forth. Make cool. sense? Yeah. Cool. So let's come back. Let's come back. Let's come back to this. So let me let me share with you again the four types of people, right? So the number one person looks at all this and goes, "That's awesome case." But all I could do the whole time you were doing that was figuring out how I'm going to send my 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 friends and my family and my clients cards from their phone. I just want to be a customer. Okay, so that's the number one. Okay. That's thirty nine bucks a month. You get you signed up tonight. Number two is a referral partner. Looks at this and goes, "That's awesome. The photo booth business is taking up eighty hours a week." But I certainly see the value of this. I certainly know people we can talk to, and I'm happy to refer you business. Call that a referral partner, number two. Number three is somebody that is going, oh my gosh, this is so brilliant, this is awesome. And I've got a car payment or a student loan payment or a rent payment. I want to make like a thousand bucks a month. What can we do to put together a plan to make a thousand bucks a month? Call that a part-time income person. And a four of a number four is somebody that goes, Oh my gosh, dude, you literally like showed me how to do a stupid card out of the phone app and took a card that was in order and laid them out and you're just following these little cards it's like the easiest thing on the planet like let's go to work and let's build a business right, right. i certainly can bring a bunch of people here let's just go make some money so here's the big the, the the big question based on what you saw here tonight if you were to make a decision tonight number one being a customer and number two being a referral partner and number three being a uh, part-time income person and number four being a full-time incomer which one would you be Okay? okay? Now, awesome. So for you guys at home, I've specifically asked Gabe not to answer the question because I don't want to have him have any pressure because there's a bunch of people here and you guys are all watching. So I hope this was helpful. Um, I appreciate you guys being here. And this will be posted up on YouTube in the next day or so. You guys have a great night. Any questions, reach out and I'm happy to help. And if you're watching this as somebody who's never seen this presentation, Either get back with the person that, that brought you here and invited you here or reach out and ask me any questions. I'm happy to help in any way I can. We'll see you guys later.